Hello everybody, it's Philip from PMA7 and this is our week 4 project video. In this video we're going to talk about our game design called Top or Not. This is the social search ranking game. Well, what exactly does that mean? Well, it's actually very simple. This game comes over here and pulls a list of random terms from the Google Trends top charts. And it's going to pull a term from any of the categories that we have. Currently, there's always 46 active categories open at a single time. And then each category has 10 terms in it. The user is going to be presented with two terms, and they have to figure out which of these two terms either appeared higher or lower than the other term in their respective rankings. Very simple. You're just choosing higher or lower, and you're going from there. Get it right, you get points. Don't get it right, you move on to the next level. And there's only three rounds per game, and it's meant to be fast and fun. So let's go back to the game and show you what it looks like here. So this is the main feel of the game here. We've got Top or Not, the uh, social uh, search ranking game. We'll go ahead and go to the main screen here. It is a nice, easy feel of a game. It looks kind of paper drawn, which is wonderful, but there's still some nice, strong textual elements that are in here. We'll go ahead and click on play to go ahead and start the game for the first time. And as we can see here, we have three individual sections. At the top, we actually have our game itself. In the middle, we have our timer. At the bottom, we have our score and personal keeper information. In the gameplay itself, we are separated two by two terms with a qualifier. It tells us choose which one is higher, so it chooses the word higher, and we have to choose which one scored the highest. So as we can see here, there is a first time play in this game. We get a tutorial hint. It says click this one, it's higher. So we're going to go ahead and click it. And now we're presented again. We have another higher choice. And we have to choose, well, which one, horses or summer, do we think actually scored the highest? Hmm. Let's say horses. Yes. George Lucas or Bob Dole? Which one scored that? Now, as you notice, we're progressing through. We're gaining points. We're going to choose Bob Dole. We finished our game. There's only three rounds. The goal is finish all three rounds as fast and accurate as possible to get as many points as you possibly can and then share that out to anybody else. Once the game is over, you have the potential to earn medals, as you can see here. Share out your score to your friends and go ahead and link it to the uh, global leaderboards as well as we can see down there at the bottom. You, of course, can go ahead and play again or go back to the main menu. I'm going to click play again so you can see that there is a lower choice. So we have to choose the lower of the two. Which one scored the lowest? Pacific Rim or Toast? Uh, I don't know. It was Pacific Rim. Wonderful. And then we just choose again on highest and lowest. That's all there really is to this game. It's meant to be fast. It's meant to be quick. Between all three rounds, you literally only have 15 seconds. So it's five seconds per round. Answer them quickly, you get the most points. As you can see here, we do have a global leaderboard that's linked to the Game Center. Allows you to see your daily, weekly, monthly, yearly, and all-time scores. And allows you just a quick way to see where you rank. The game mechanic is very simple when it comes to play. The user is going to click play, choose the one that's higher or lower based on the qualifier that's in the center. If they get it wrong, it literally moves on. If they get it right, their points increase at the bottom. So as we can see, they got it correct. We now have a star down here rating that it got correct. We're currently on the second level. We have time ticking away right here. And we can see that we still have one more level to go. And now we're on the third level. We got another one correct and now we're actually finished. So it's very fast and a very easy way of playing this. And with that, guys, I hope you enjoy uh, Top or Not. If you have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, have a great and wonderful week.